scientists have observed the heaviest black hole merger ever found. On May 21, 2019, three telescopes on Earth received powerful gravitational waves far away from the depths of space. Scientists detected these waves on May 21, 2019, using the twin LIGO detectors located in Livingston, Louisiana, and Hanford, Washington, and the Virgo detector located near Pisa, Italy. The signal coming from the event, known as GW190521, lasted just one-tenth of a second. About 10 billion years ago, two highly spinning mammoth black holes, weighing in at 85 and 66 times the mass of the Sun, merged together, converting about eight solar masses into pure energy in the form of gravitational radiation. Scientists consider the larger of the two black holes to be impossible. Astronomers predict that stars that could give birth to black holes with masses between 65 to 130 times greater than the Sun undergo a process called pair instability. That's when a star blows apart and leaves nothing behind. One suggestion is that the larger object was created by a previous black hole merger rather than a collapsing star. The new heavy black hole merger happened when the universe was only about 7 billion years old. That's roughly half its present age. Although the signal was short, just four up and down wave cycles, the team could still analyze it, parsing out its amplitude, its shape, and how its frequency changed over time. The big merger formed an even larger black hole, weighing a whopping 142 times the mass of the Sun. That's by far the largest black hole ever observed through gravitational wave observations. When a black hole is 100 to 100,000 times more massive than the Sun, it's called an intermediate mass black hole. They are heavier than stellar mass black holes, but lighter than supermassive black holes, which lie at the centers of galaxies. The event confirms that the merger of two small black holes can produce an intermediate black hole. The bottom line is that we've just witnessed the heaviest black hole merger ever directly seen, and that led to the first definitive detection of an intermediate mass black hole.